exciting day today as a new spike ball season is starting. Welcome to the first spike ball match of the season. Well, the Walsh tank goes after just storming off. Hello, son. Dad. My team are terrible. Will you play for my under 12 team? You want me to play under 12s? It's a million euro point. I'm in. We got a new player. What a beast. He looks about 20. He's not 20, he's age appropriate. Age appropriate? Isn't that what we like to say? He looks about 20. Don't say that again. Okay, okay. Look at their new player, he's like seven foot tall. That player above is the best player I've ever seen in my life! <laughs> Decided to choose the next round. What a win! Today we have Walsh Town versus the Bears. The ball doesn't come off and nobody else touches the ball. But that's a cheat. Screwing's <laughs> team, Bob doesn't come off. What? That's cheating. No, it isn't. That's the match. Walters Town wins. Wow, a surprising win from Walters Town. Well, Bob truly is a superstar. I see you two are very busy. We're always busy. You have to be really good and not stay cautious to be a detective. Yeah, okay. Do you fall spike ball? Not really. Yeah, isn't it one of the most popular sports in Ireland at the moment? You surely can't be bigger than Gaelic soccer. Okay, but I'm not here to talk about sports. Look at that kid. He's huge. And he's under 12? Mm -hmm. He's bigger than me. He must be excellent. Yeah, his team in the tournament. 50,000 for nationals, 1 million for internationals. That's a lot of money. Here, he's too big to play with the I'm going down to see the next match. Semi finals day. This is going to go watch the match, get some evidence there. <laughs> Let's do some detective work. Nobody touched the ball. Very suspicious. After that match, now we know we have two cheating coaches and a cheating 20 year old. Hello? Hello, nice night precinct. To report a cheating scandal. There's a person on our spike ball team who claims he's 12, but he's actually around 20. What? 20? We'll be right there. Hurrah! It was one of his own teammates. Let's get it. Let's go. I'm going to go out. You play the blind up today. Are you going to come over on Sunday to have dinner? Your mum hasn't seen you in the Hey, John. John? What you got there? Look at this poster I made for Bob. He is my favourite player. I can't wait to go and see him at his next match. You do know that we pretty much have him caught for age conspiracy, fraud and cheating. Well, yeah, I know, but he is still a very good player. We could use the fact that you're a super fan. <gasps> I could go and get to talk to Bob. Just give him confidence and flash him. Get him talking. I'm going to chase down the birth search. Let's get these rats. When did you start playing spike ball? Well, I started when I was four, then in primary school, then up to secondary school, then up to college. And I'm hoping to go prof I mean, that's my plan for the future. It's finally here. Finals day. Walters Town against Portugal, Ireland. This is going to get that 50,000. I need a new car. I need to fill up this envelope, envelope with more money because I want to go on a holiday. I'm still dreaming about that million. Arrest for any conspiracy, bribery, and fraud. You know what? I'm glad he's gone. I don't even think I touched the ball yet. He did. That's why I rang the detectives. My shoulder's killing me from when he knocked me over. And Lily's gone to the emergency room. We have no coach, no best player, but we can win this. Let's show them our talent. Let's show them our determination. Let's, Let's win this! Well, let's show them what we can do without the ball. dramatic end to an intense competition. I can't believe that we witnessed a cheating scandal.